the character doesn't belong to me. Uh, he's still absolutely Joe's and she's worked with Jack and John to, to pick up the story 19 years later. To me it is actually quite interesting to hit round about the 40 mark of your life and consider how things which affected you profoundly when you were 11 going on 17 and how that is going to start to come into play uh, into your life as a dad and uh, affect the kind of decisions that you make and the way you make those decisions. So really that's where, that's where the play gets juicy for me. I've never worked on a play where I've heard audible gasps from audiences, not because of some amazing special effects, although we are getting those, but it's just release of information. It's just things that these characters are saying to each other. You know, you, sp you spend a large part of any theatre performance convincing people that they've done the right thing and buying the ticket and that this is a story that they want to hear. We hit the ground running on that front. You know, they, they want to be here. They want to know what happens. They're desperately hungry to be told this story. So they've been nothing but wind in our sails from the very, very get-go. Um, and, uh, and it's a joy.